So now for a real showstopper of a craft project. This wreath chandelier will really look fabulous in your home and making it is not as hard as you may think. You'll need two Martha Stewart Living Winslow Fir pre-lit wreaths from the Home Depot for this particular project. So this is a 24 inch wreath, which is the top tier of the chandelier. And this is the spectacular 36 inch wreath, which will be the bottom tier. And we're using tartan wire edged ribbon. They come on rolls of 15 feet. And these are from the Christmas cheer collection. You'll need two 46 inch ribbons cut from one of your rolls and tie securely to one side of your wreath and then directly across, tie the other end of the ribbon. It has wire in it, so be careful of your fingers. So that's one. And now your other goes in the opposite direction. And depending on the height of your ceiling and the distance from the floor that you want this chandelier to be hung, you can adjust the lengths of your ribbons, of course. So this gets put right on. I have an S-hook and a carabiner or latch here. So that's hanging just like that. So you see that's the beginning of our fabulous project. Add the second wreath. And this has been tied with two 74 inch ribbons on four opposing sides. And notice there's a plug. So these are pre-lit too. So they're gonna make spectacular chandeliers when they are illuminated. And so this, just draw right up and put this on your latch. Looking pretty good. You can leave it like that if you want, but I think embellishing with these amazing ornaments. These are beautiful glass ornaments from the Christmas cheer collection. And I've pre-wired all of the ornaments so that they are going to hang securely. You don't have to worry about them falling and breaking. And you just twist the wires right onto the wreath form. So there's a pretty spectacular one. And here is another one. So to make a beautiful puffy ribbon for the top of your lovely chandelier, I think a 14 inch wide bow would be kind of effective. So start with a, about a seven inch loop here and another loop there, all, all together about 14 inches end to end. And just go back and forth. And you can use up the entire 15 feet to make a spectacular top bow. And twist your wire. Make it tight because you want that center to be very, almost invisible. And then fluff out your loops. So there you have a spectacular chandelier. It'll look great in a room with a tall ceiling, in an entryway, on a porch, and no one will believe that you made it yourself. Enjoy. Mm -hmm.